Y'all, it is six o'clock in the morning. I have a huge stack of leftovers here and my new Orange Umbrella Co. sticker book. We are ready to play. I have no idea what I'm doing, but we are just gonna figure it out together, friends. And we are gonna fill this friend. Like this is my friend, my new friend. And we are gonna fill this buddy with all of my leftovers. I have no rhyme or reason to what I'm doing right now, but we're gonna figure it out together. Together, we are gonna figure this out. Basically, we're gonna take this semblance of mess here and hopefully create something beautiful and magical within this gorgeous Orange Umbrella Co. sticker book that just says stickers, this gorgeous floral pattern here, gorgeous floral pattern on the back, got the Orange Umbrella Co. logo here. The sticker paper quality is just gorgeous. The pages don't stick together. They just glide effortlessly along the coil, friends. No better quality than an Orange Umbrella Co. reusable sticker book. I'm telling you, if you've had other ones in the past that stick together, you know what I'm talking about. Go get you an Orange Umbrella Co. one. You will not be disappointed, friends. You will not be disappointed. I promise you. All right, so my plan of attack here is to start with Cricut Paper Co. just because their stickers are a little bit different, friends, and um, they're like vinyl-y, and I have like quite a bit of, a little bit of a stack of theirs. So I'm gonna put theirs either at the front, I think actually, let's just put theirs at the back, like the last few pages, and then we'll put all the rest of the stuff at the front, and then I'll leave all like the scripts that are left, and we'll put those in my other book. So let's get started. So I think I'm gonna leave like, Maybe five pages for Cricut Paper Co. One, two, three, four, five. And I think that should be enough. I don't, like I have um, quite a few, but I'm not gonna save everything that's in here. I'm just gonna save like some of the stuff. Like these icons and stuff are gonna go in a separate section. I'm only gonna put like functional things here from Cricut Paper Co. So these icons are gonna go like, somewhere in the front with the other icons even though they're vinyl i know that doesn't make sense with what i'm telling you right now but yeah we're gonna put icons somewhere near the front so these are gonna go off to the side those are gonna be in a special place but this part this back part is gonna be like all the creaky paper co like functional things so we're gonna put like with like and uh why not just start with scallop doodle boxes because that's what the first thing is here, so well, let's just get to it. And I'll probably talk through a little bit of this and then I'll probably, you know, um, fast forward through a lot of this because you don't wanna hear me jibber jabbering through, you know, the whole thing because that would be quite boring. But I don't know, maybe you do. Maybe you do, friends, maybe you do. But it looks like there's a few more of these scallopy doodle boxes here. So let's just get these off. So these new tweezers are literally the sharpest things in the toolbox I've ever seen. Holy crap, they're so freaking sharp. Like I feel like it's gonna cut cut me some stickers here. So I just gotta be real careful with these guys. Super careful, friends. I almost have to like peel the sticker off and then put them on, if that makes sense, friends. But yeah, this is such a big pile of stickers. Like these these um, um, heart checklist boxes, I'm not keeping because I don't generally use them. So, but like this box I want to keep, so that's why I'm still holding on to those, if that makes sense, guys. And like this fun one is gonna go more like up in the front with like the icons. So that one's gonna go off to the side too. Oh, I found another one. I know I don't have a ton of these cause I, I do tend to use them cause they're so fun. And I do like vinyl stickers. I think they're 
super swell. The only thing is I wish I had like a micro perm or something else to write with them on. Write with them with. And then like these doodle girls, I just, I don't really use them a lot, so I don't think I'm gonna keep them. I'll put them off to the side just in case. Oh, I found one more, one last little scallop doodle. And then I think that's gonna be it for the scallop doodles. And then let's go with, um, I guess these guys. Which I don't think there was a ton of these. And then this like um, box here, I'm not gonna keep because I'm not. It's very specific, so I'm not gonna keep it. Is that the same size? No, that's a little bigger. I think that might be all friends for that size. Yep. All right. So. Now, let's go with these. I think the vinyl ones, it might be easier just for me to use my hands, honestly. And I think this is the same size here, so. A little bit crooked, that's all right. save these either because I generally don't use them but let's see what I can squeeze in here maybe these little um, these little guys right here because I don't think I have a ton of those no I'm not gonna I don't think they're all gonna fit darn Here, I thought I didn't have very many. Look at all these little guys. This is fun, but man, is that gonna time time consuming? I feel like I've been doing this forever already, and we're only on Cricut Paper Co. We're definitely gonna have to speed this video up. But the hope is, friends, that when I'm done planning a week, and we'll see how how well this works. But when I'm done planning a week, that I will go in every week, lol, and put my leftovers away right away. We'll see how well that happens, but that's the plan. And aside from Cricut Paper Co., I'm hoping that I can put stuff away by, like, color. Either that or, like, by box size. I don't know what, what the best way to do it is. But I'm kind of thinking by color. I think that's how most people do it, is, like, by color. Because I think it's easier to, like, find that way. So, I kind of think that's how I'm going to do it, is by color. So then this sheet is done. Oh no, I want to see the little hearts. I have a song from High School Musical stuck in my head, friends. I don't even know how it got there. All right, that one's done. Feels good to get done with the sheet because I feel like I've been doing this forever, like I already said. Oh, and look at that one. That one's done, I didn't even realize. Oh, and this one too. Okay, those ones are done. All right, now let's put these little guys down. These ones are so fun.
I don't generally use these a ton, but I'm trying to get more into them. I know, that's the random song I have stuck in my head. It's from High School Musical 2, friends. All right, now, function. these things have a tracker, so I'm gonna put off to the side too, because I'm gonna put those more like in the front as well. Somehow, how out of nowhere, I was just reminded of Hawaii and how I want a Dole Whip so bad. Oh my goodness, those were so good. If you've ever been to Disney, I think they, I know they have them there. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about, friends. Okay, we're getting close. We're getting close to the end here. I don't know. Yeah, there's not any more that are directly like that. There's just like these other guys. So now it's basically going to be the mishmash of everything else. And the scripts, I think I'm just gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe just cut this off and figure it out later. I don't know what to do with these bows. I wanna save them, but I don't wanna save them here. So I think I'm gonna put those with like the, the deco. And the same with, oh no, these, these, ones, is, these ones can go over here. These guys I'm gonna save to put with the deco because these are like more deco-ish to me. And then I'll cut these out and save the words. Is this my last Cricut Paper Co. sheet? Oh, I better hurry up. Hopefully I don't run out of space here. I'm not gonna save these, and then I think these are all gonna go with my doodly things. And then these are gonna go with my doodly things, and then these are gonna go with my doodly things. So that was perfect. Five pages was perfect. Okay, so then this first page is gonna be like doodly things. So now we can put down all the fun doodly things. And I think hubby is up. It's so early, why are you up hubby? Read, I'm not gonna keep. Bill do, I'll keep. Although I probably should have put like a space between these. I was right, he's awake. So part of this is just gonna be me not talking. And I'm just gonna be laying down stickers, which is fine, friends. I'll talk when I can. So, let me go back to this first page. He went to bed early, though, so I'm not surprised. Oh, and we have a laundry one now. Put laundry in the middle. Groceries. And that sheet's done.
friends. I think that's where I'm gonna have to leave you. Uh, we got a lot done, but I was super ambitious, over ambitious, and I still have a crazy stack left next to me. But yeah, that's all I'm gonna be able to do today because it's now seven of two and I gotta jump in the shower before I go to work. So thanks and uh, look forward to part two. Thank you guys, bye.